All right, how's it going, everybody? This is 2019 Bowman Baseball HJ Jumbo 8 box case break. Pick your team's number six. Sold out on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Here's the list of who got what team. All teams sold straight up, I believe, in this one. So appreciate everyone getting in. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to open all the packs first for this break. So you can fast forward through the first maybe 20 minutes or so of the video. Um, and you'll be able to see all of the cards on that camera above my head as well. So everything will be on the table. Good luck. Got a full case here. So yeah, open all of the uh, all of the boxes first here. Get started. What's up, Rex? How's it going? All right, so like I said, you'll be able to see all of the, the pack stack on that camera as well. So yeah, if you're watching on YouTube, you can fast forward through this. And I will be doing hit recap also, so. If you want to. Watch that. Yeah, I, I would say so, Rex. Probably about 6.30 Eastern, 5.30 Central, 3.30 in Pacific, uh, 12.30 p.m. If you're in Hawaii, I think. I think they're three hours behind. Um, not sure any other... Uh, Time zones, I don't think, off the top of my head. Japan, maybe they're like 12 hours or 13 hours ahead. So, And at the end of the break, we should have 24 autographs. So make sure everything stays on camera here. Let's put these boxes more towards the back so we have more room. Australia, I have no idea. I'd like to go there one day, but I don't, I'm not sure on the time difference. I just guessed 12 hours for every, every other country. Alaska, what time does Alaska go by? Pacific? They have to go by Pacific, right? We have some customers in Alaska. What time is it there? It's got to be the same time, I think. So, yeah, we have another jumbo case in the store now. We also have a jumbo random teams. I think we do have another hobby or two. Um, I'll probably wait to post that until that Jumbo Random Team goes. Kind of hold out on that. Um, so check it out. He's not that short, Rex. Come on. Alaska time. We need one. We need a Alexa during the break. After. Oh, they're one power behind Pacific time. Gotcha. Okay. That makes sense then. So it's what? It's a 111? Okay. Thanks, Patrick. Now, you, now I know. Accidental bell ring there, but maybe it's a good luck, good luck sign for this uh, this case. 
So once again, there is the break order right now. This should probably take about 40 minutes, this Bowman Jumbo. And then we have Black Gold Football Pick Your Team 11. That'll probably take about 20 minutes. And then after that is Flawless Football. Pick Your Team Numero Uno. What's up, SMJ? Yeah, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Please check it out. I think I need to move that third camera. Maybe a little this way. Can't buy a spot in this one though. It's already already sold out. Yep, there's the link. Check it out. There's our website, jazbeescasebreaks.com. This one is sold out, so we can't buy a spot in this one. But we have a bunch of other breaks breaking tonight, so. So yeah, Jumbo Pick Your Team 7 in the store now. It's at slightly higher prices than what this one was at, just because we got that 7th case at a later date at a higher price. So, unfortunately, I had to raise it. But no team went up too bad. I mean, nothing over 5 10%, I don't think. So, so some pretty good stuff to be had in this Bowman Jumbo. I haven't been keeping track of what super fractor has been pulled or anything like that i know the i saw the vladimir guerrero jr non-autograph super fractor pulled i don't know if like the franco or the luciano or the bart or the any of those were, were pulled yet There's the schedule. Don't have any basketball breaks sold out, so that's why we're not doing it. The status was done last night, so that status already broke. So you can see on that camera above as well, all the cards laid out. What are we at nine minutes so far? And I will be doing a hit recap as well as a, a serial number recap. 
after the break in a separate video. So if you don't want to watch the full video, you don't have to. Yeah, I think we need to sell it to Spot Random, Eric. I'm pretty sure the Spot Random saw has some spots in there for the Browns and the Giants. But it's only at like 12 left. So that'll definitely be going tonight. next couple hours I, I would bet Yeah, the Browns and Giants are pretty expensive, so. Figured I'd, I'd put them in there. But I think we started out with 25 in there, so. Should be gone pretty soon. Two boxes to go. And we'll reveal what we've been unpacking. No super fractor from our cases yet, so hopefully that comes out soon. I know, right, Rex? Unbelievable. I just need a, a robot to uh, to do it. Pack open a robot 1.0. And I think my liquid top loader idea, I think that's a legit idea. So, be pursuing both of those. Spray on top loader. And pack opener, robot. So two packs from box seven. Hey, what's up, Gavin? Um, we haven't run that yet. Um, we usually do the spot randoms right before the actual break. Um, that's gonna be breaking about an hour and fifteen minutes or so, maybe a little less. These two breaks sold out first, so we have we just go by the order of what they uh what they sell out in breakers truck oh like a like a food truck yeah that's a good idea too although i think part of the whole allure with breaking is a lot of people Everyone can watch it from their house and just in their underwear. So I think that's part of it. It's just like how the movies aren't as popular anymore. Movie theaters, everyone watches, streams it. 
But yeah, I mean, break the trucks. You can bring them to like companies and stuff. I saw, I was at uh, like a medical office and they had, for all of the nurses and doctors, they had like an in and out truck. So they brought in and out to the to the place. It was insane. few more packs to go then we can see what we got it's been 15 minutes so yeah not bad not bad time the jumbos are a little harder to open than the hobbies because they stuff all these cards into this pack it makes it a little harder to open the pack but hobby is more packs so I think it evens out pretty much. Yeah, I guess. I guess so. If you're in, like, San Francisco, yeah, that's legal. Alright. So we're gonna move. Remember, you can see all the cards above my head. That's a live camera. Not recording. Alright. So we're going to go through all the hits, sleeve all of the, uh, the stuff. So here we go. Good luck, everybody. We can do these first. I'm sorry if the camera goes a little out of focus, but I'll show all the, the major stuff on here. Remember, no paper ships, but all of the chrome inserts and all the autographs, of course. First autograph is for the tribe. That is Aaron Savali. Auto. Cleveland Indians. That one's going out to Big Boy 007. What's up, Ryan? Yeah, it's flawless day. That's why I came in a little early. Break this uh, Bowman Jumbo. So Joe has as much time as possible to get through. All of the flawless on the site. Why does it look like there's an earthquake on the camera? I was like, does this camera know something I don't? Is it like a pre-warning for an earthquake? some base there's Kyle Tucker so first autograph Indians Aaron Savali looks like we've got a gold coming up gold of Michelle Baez Michael Baez maybe 17 out of 75 that one's for the Padres. That one's going out to John Anderson. And like I said, I'll be doing a, a serial number recap, all the serial numbered cards, and all the autographs in a separate video. Alex Kirloff, I think he's going to be very, very good for the, uh, for the Minnesota Twins. Definitely one of the best hitters in the minor league system. It has been a while, actually. But, I mean, they've also been saying that for a while, so. First earthquake I felt here, I think it was the night of this Manny, the Manny Pacquiao-Floyd Mayweather fight. It was pretty, pretty big one, actually. I think it was around a 4.0 or something. And it was at, at like 4 a.m. too. That was, so that was it. Uh, we have to 499 Max Scherzer and to 499 Matthew Libatori.
We got a blue, number 150, John Duplantier. 41 out of 150 for the Arizona Diamondbacks. Paper base there. There is a refractor autograph for the Minnesota Twins. That is Andrew Bechtold. 372 out of 499. Minnesota Twins, Bill. There you go, Bill. Um, yeah, like I said, I've never really been in a, a serious earthquake, so I don't want to, like, offend somebody who actually has been. But basically just everything shakes for a few seconds, and then, and then it's over. Like I said, I haven't been in any serious one, so. <clears throat> I think the one that I'm talking about on the, the fight night was, like, maybe 10 seconds long. And, I mean, like, maybe a couple of plates fell over or something. So it wasn't anything, like, destructive, Thank, thankfully. But it was pretty scary, so I, I can't imagine what a, what a real big one would feel like. All right. We got an Atomic Autograph, number 100 for the Blue Jays. That is Danny Jansen. Love these Atomics. Blue Jays is Joe Pete. Yeah, and then and then yeah, you gotta you gotta be careful because there's always a yeah like the aftershock, um, and all that. But I mean, I also lived on the East Coast too, and like Hurricane Sandy, that was a lot more destructive than than any earthquake I've been in so kind of take it take and leave it but um the scary thing about earthquakes obviously is you don't know when they're coming really hurricanes at least you have a little bit of uh, a warning all right we got DJ Stewart number 250 purple for the Orioles Base. Yeah, anything above, yeah, anything above four, you can definitely, definitely kind of uh, get a little scared. I think there's a little one by us. Um, in the middle of the night a few nights ago. All right, we got a Speckle autograph to two ninety nine for the Padres. That is Tirso Ornelas. 263 out of 299. San Diego Padres, that one's going out to John Anderson. Did I say it was going to somebody else before? Padres is, yeah, John Anderson. I'm losing my mind. We got Royce Lewis to 150, blue paper. But yeah, um, yeah, and then obviously the big one in San Francisco during the, uh, the World Series. Yeah, so there's been definitely some some time between the last one we got a keegan thompson refractor out of the 499 chicago cubs greg oh really that's crazy yeah i've seen the 30 for 30 on that all right we have for the dodgers it's a chrome prospect autograph purple refractor parallel diego Cartaya. Diego Cartaya, that is Dodgers. Purple autograph, that is going to Jeremy Tillman. Um, this is Jumbo. 
What's up, 03 Sports Cards? This is Jumbo Picker Team 6. Number 7 is in the store now. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com So we got some base. Um, I think like the late seventies. We got a Nate Pearson blue shimmer, forty eight out of one twenty five for Toronto. Got a Brent Rooker to four ninety nine refractor for twins. There's an atomic autograph number to one hundred for the Rockies. That is Vince Fernandez, seventy four out of one hundred. Nice one there, Minnesota, uh, Colorado Rockies. Almost said twins. Uh, that is going out to Darren. Well, I think... Yeah, I mean, you never know, I guess. I think he was in a group called the CBs, though. So I think it was different than... Than the normal. What's up, Silver Stacker? How's it going? You got a Justin Dunn at two ninety nine, Seattle. Base autograph for the Diamondbacks, Blaze Alexander. Chris G with the Diamondbacks. Great name, Blaze Alexander. Got number 250, Starling Marte. And number to 499, Peter Lambert. Knocking through here. This is Bowman Jumbo. Pick your team six. Got a teal number to one twenty five. Ian Anderson. Oh yeah, I think yeah. So yeah, maybe. That'd be pretty crazy.
All right, we got an atomic number to 150. Letty Tavares, Texas. And we have a Brent Hicklin to 499 for the Royals. There's Tatis. There's a Brent Rooker to 299. There's a Gold Shimmer autograph. Very nice for the Tampa Bay Rays. That is Ronaldo Hernandez. 34 out of 50. Nice hit there. Tampa. Daniel D. Not a, not a Franco, but still a pretty nice one there. Got some base. We got a purple autograph, Casey Golden, to 250. Colorado, that's going to Darren Porter. I always like when the, the refractor matches the uniform. I think that look, always looks sharp. Fractured 499, Justin Dunn. Atomic, Kansas City, triple, number 150 for the Royals. Yeah, we hit a speckle auto uh, of, uh, of Franco to 299, so I think that's got to be at least a thousand bucks there. Refractor auto, Kobe Allard. 69 out of 4.99. Factor rookie auto. I think Hernandez owes for the Rays is a pretty good prospect too. Maybe unless I'm thinking of somebody else, but I'm pretty sure f um, or Hernandez is uh, is pretty good. I was looking at the top 100 yesterday. I'm trying to go all in on a guy. I don't know who who I want to go in though, on and prospect as they call it. I've done it for football before, never for baseball. And I don't have a budget to do obviously Wander Franco. Maybe one autograph and that's it. So I was trying to find some, maybe like a under the radar player or something like that. But yeah, I think I mean I think Franco is a huge ceiling. For sure. Signed as a, a free agent, international free agent a couple years ago. And I think he hit in like rookie ball or like single A or one of those like Appalachian League. He hit like three fifty, so and he was eighteen. So imagine what he he can do in a couple years. Dylan Cease to one twenty five. <clears throat> That's White Sox.
There's a base autograph, Keegan Thompson. Doubled up there. Cubs. Greg. Yeah, I think he, if I remember correctly, he's probably out of my, my range too. And I like Joe Adele a lot, but his autograph from Bowman Chrome. Base auto. Cool, like $1,000, I think. Maybe a little less. Jay Groom to 250 for the Boston Red Sox purple paper. So, don't think I can quite go in on him. Although, now's the time to buy him. Uh, Gratero to 150, Twins. I remember Mike Trout, I think 2012 National, 2013 National. Mike Trout, 2009 Bowman Chrome is his uh, first Bowman Chrome auto. I think the seller wanted 1500 on it, and I, was, I didn't want to pay that much. Now it's, I think, like a $10,000 card. So I do have a lot of regretful sales. I don't remember any of the sales that I made that were good sales. Looking back on it, I always remember the bad ones. I had a I had a Giannis silver auto to twenty five from his Prism rookie year. Sold that way too early. There's there's some bad ones. I, I had some Patrick Mahomes last year that I sold before the season started. Just some rough ones. There's Adam Hazley to four ninety nine. Eli Morgan. Base autograph for the Cleveland Indians, Big Boy 007. <clears throat> I saw that. Yeah, I saw you uh, You mentioned that in the chat yesterday. That's pretty crazy. Yeah, I mean, there's definitely some hidden gems out there in, in, in wax for sure. There's a Connor Capel to 499 refractor autograph. Another one for Dave and the tribe. I think it's the third autograph for the Indians. The one that gets talked about the most is um, the Evan Longoria Super Fractor autograph. I don't think it's ever seen the light of day. And it's like 2007 Bowman Chrome or something like that. I don't think I think he's the only really big one to chase, so it makes it kind of tough if you're trying to chase that card. But it's never been never been seen before. I don't think it's kind of a a hobby legend. There some there's conspiracy theories about it, unless like in the last year or two that it's been uncovered and I don't know about it. Jeff McNeil to four ninety nine. There's like theories that it was never made or that's a really big pocket collector just ripped the case and never posted that he pulled it or something or she pulled it. Peter Alonzo to 125 for the Mets. That's a nice one. He's been off to a great start. Michael has the Mets. Yeah, it's Bowman. Pretty sure it's a Bowman. Like, yeah, it's like first Bowman card. I don't know what year or what kind of brand. Bowman Chrome or Bowman or Bowman Draft. I forget if they had that back then. But if you look it up, I think there is some uh, some info about it. Matt Mercer, Diamondbacks, base autograph, Chris G.
Franklin Cologne to four ninety nine. Christian Santana for the Dodgers. Jeremy Tillman. Yeah, that's true, too. That is true, too. That's like the Ty Cobb cut autograph that came from a blaster box. I mean, the majority of people opening blasters and stuff are, I mean, a lot of kids open that kind of stuff. Get it at Target or Walmart. So it definitely is pretty crazy. Yeah, I'm sure that's a theory, too, floating out there that a kid pulled it and, and went out, <laughs> went into the dumpster or something. But I don't know. They don't do super fractors in retail, usually. So I don't know if it... But it could be just he went to his local hobby shop and bought a pack, opened it at home or something. But, I mean, if I had to guess, it, I bet it's still... In a sealed case somewhere. We got a purple paper to two fifty, Kesson Herora. Longest streak of the year. Are they gonna? You think they're gonna re-sign Joe Madden, Rex? I love Joe Madden to come out to the Angels. My Angels are a mess. Lost 10-11 to the Rangers last night. Pujols is a disaster. Cole Calhoun stinks. It's just a mess. Matt Harvey's the worst pitcher ever. He's so bad. I don't know what they were thinking with him. Even if, I mean, I wouldn't have paid him $100,000, let alone a million, or whatever they paid him. Just not great, not great. Have Mike Trout, though, so that, I mean, can always yeah, fall back on that. Yeah, I think Angels are below 500. They started off crappy, then they went on a, a nice little tear, nice little run, and then now they've kind of fallen back. But I didn't expect them to compete too much this year anyway. Edward Cabrera to 499. Next year we'll have Joe Adele probably called up. Otani will be healthy. Upton will be healthy. We'll still have Trout, and hopefully they get... Some uh, some pitching for agents. Hopefully Pujols retires. Cole Calhoun will be gone. Joe Adele will replace Calhoun. There's another Capel base auto for the Indians. David H. Yeah, I guess it gives him a little extra incentive, right? Coaching for his job, but... Then again, I'm sure he'd love to uh, to know that he signed for another couple years. There's Jordan Adams to 4.99 for the Angels. There's a refractor autograph, Casey Golden to 4.99. Believe the second one there. Colorado going to 
Darren Porter. Yeah, Brad Ausmus is the Angels' new... I don't know. I don't know about him. I mean... And I was thinking, what sport probably... There's 499, Ahmed Rosario. There's to 250, Nick Senzel. I was thinking what sport the, the coach or the manager matters the least. I think football is really important, obviously. I mean, let's say every sport is important, but what's the least important? Maybe basketball? Baseball, maybe? I don't know. Hockey, I guess? I think hockey would be pretty important. But I mean, so Cubs have enough talent. They'll be they'll be pretty solid for I mean, obviously the Darvish contract looks pretty bad and so does the Hayward, but My Angels also signed Hamilton and Pools to, to bad deals too and and they had the best record four or five years ago at that time, so All right, speckle autograph. Andrew Beck told 184 out of 299 for the Twins. Why is it doing that? Hi, how's it going? Good, how are you? Awesome, thank you. Appreciate it. Awesome. Um, there's two Kershaws I left in another box. I'm going to sell them on Monday. Everything okay. else is there. Awesome, thanks. Cool. Appreciate it. Yeah, what kind of deal is Rizzo and Bryant on? It does suck, though. Cubs could have gotten Harper and, and kept Arietta for the price they they paid Hayward and uh, Hayward and Darvish, pretty much. That would have been a stacked team. All right, Jose Suarez for the Angels. Jared with... The Halos. Victor Mesa Jr. to four ninety nine. Man, Kyle Hendricks. 
What happened to him? He had that one really good year, right? I don't know what he's been doing since. All right, the last few stacks here. Good luck, everybody. Then I'll do a, a recap video. Why is that Harper in the middle there? There's line Richardson to two ninety nine. Cincinnati. There is a nice Francisco Lindor, thirtieth anniversary autograph number thirty. Very nice hit for Cleveland Indians who crushed this break. Big boys double oh seven. Love these cards. Nice one. There is Ryan McKenna, Speckle Autograph, 88 out of 299 for Baltimore. That's EA. Maybe the Harper's a short print. I don't know. I, I didn't think they had those in Bowman, but I put it to the side just in case. In his Phillies uniform or the first card maybe or something. There's a gold, number to 50, another Indians hit. Oh, I messed up my stacks, no. Oh, really? Huh. I didn't even know about that. There's a very nice blue number to 150, blue shimmer, Wander Franco. Nice hit for Tampa. Tampa Bay Rays, Daniel D. Who people, some people are calling one of the best hitters in minor league baseball. Only has one year under his belt. There's a Mateo Gill autograph base for St. Louis. Zach. It's card number three. And it's batting stance. Phillies uniform. Is it really a short print? There's a Aurelvis Martinez to 250 for Toronto. Oh yeah, the 2019 Bowman, blah, blah, blah. It's a variation, yeah. Wow. Dave Barrows, there you go. Who says I don't have 2020 vision? There you go. I don't need glasses. Spotted that one. All right. Yeah, that definitely is that one. It's awesome.
pretty nice case. I figured something was up with it because it was in the middle of the insert pile, which they only put, obviously, inserts in. Hey, 30 bucks, 30 bucks. That's pretty solid for a paper base card. <coughs> There's a Justice Sheffield rookie autograph Yankees. <coughs> That's Robert K. Blue Refractor Autograph for Miami, Edward Cabrera to 150. The fish going out to Eric. I go through all these? Yes. These are paper. Paper. These should be all paper as well. All right, last stack here. Good luck, everybody. Jose De La Cruz at 50, gold paper. And looks like that'll be it for this one. Let me count how many autographs we hit. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25 autographs. A bonus auto in there. So there you go. Thanks, everybody. That was Bowman Jumbo. Pick your team number six.